so this is my meat this is beef i've boiled it earlier you know and i have one <laughs> cow foot there i'm also going to be using it you can use any meat of your choice for your smoky ayamase you can also use any fish you smoke fish fry fish you know anything at all so i'm just going to be using the beef which i've boiled earlier i've seasoned it so i'm going to be cutting it because it's too big so i'm going to be dicing it little by little i'm going to show you guys you can put your meat big any size you want but i always prefer it to be you know a bit smaller so that when i'm eating it with rice i don't have to be fighting with the meat i just you know <laughs> i can just take it with the rice I cut it to the size that I know that my mouth can take and my family mouth. <laughs> so this is just how I'm dicing it as you guys can see. Yeah. So this is it. I've already diced it. So this is my vegetable oil on the cooker and I'm going to allow it to get hot and uh, you can use any oil of your choice you can use palm oil you can use olive oil any oil you use for your cooking you can use but because the kit is around you know when I'm using palm oil I have to be bleaching it and all that I don't want to stress so that's why I'm using vegetable oil I've used it before it's really nice as well so I'm just letting it to get really really hot so once it's hot, I'll be back. So guys, this is it. I just brought it out from the oven. Can you guys see? So now I'm going to go and blend it with the seed. But not with this. I think I'm going to take this one out. Yeah, this one. Bit. I'm going to take it out. But I'm going to blend it with the seed. It's better you blend it with the seed. So guys this is my stock this is beef stock it was inside the freezer so i took it out and i want meat in the microwave as you guys can see it's hot so i'm gonna be pouring it if you don't have meat stock it's okay you can just use water to blend it okay 
so now we are going to go and blend and this is one tray you know i took some of the onions out because it was too full so now i'm going to blend So I'm going to be adding, this is crayfish maggi, can you guys see, I'm going to add it, so this is it, I'm going to add it. So I'm going to close it to cook for about 20 minutes, I'll be back to check on it in another 20 minutes. And I'll be staring on it, I'll be checking on it behind the camera, maybe every for five minutes. I'll be missing it so it doesn't burn. Okay, so as you guys can see, the water is dry. I didn't add water when I was blending it, I just add the stock. I use uh, the stock I show you guys, that is all I use to blend. You know, so how it looks it smells so good now i'm going to add my fried meat smells so delicious like i know this will be alerting my neighbor right now so i'm gonna close it for another few minutes and I don't think I show you guys earlier. I boil egg behind the camera. So my egg is ready. I'll be adding egg. So I'm just going to peel my egg. I'm always scared to peel egg because I always peel it with this with the white one, the white egg. Now this one is doing well. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna peel it nicely and I'm going to add it to my ayamase. It's not bad. Look at that. It's not bad. So let me finish peeling the remaining three. I finished peeling. I'm gonna put it there. And this is what I'm talking about. Can you guys see when I was peeling it? That one just came up. So I'm still gonna add it like that anyway. So let's go and add it to our sauce. you don't know about the sauce like what do you eat with this you eat it with white rice it's so delicious with white rice oh my days white rice with beans or just white rice or boiled yam you can even eat it with okra soup whatever i've tried it before it was so delicious <laughs> mm. so i'm just tasting it 
chicken and then um, it's sweet but there's not enough salt so you guys you know me now instead of salt i'll be adding aromat to taste not too much not too much Let's taste. Mmm, delicious. That's it. All done. Mm. So, it's not quite ready. I'm going to leave it for another 10 15 more minutes on medium heat. So that I can cook properly, slowly cook. So the sauce can combine with the beef, with the fried beef, and with the egg. So I'm going to leave it for 10 to 15 minutes and I'll be staring on it. I won't just leave it. I'll be staring on it. Okay? Make sure you close it. Okay. This is 15 minutes later and I've been staring on it. I've been... <laughs> is it staring on it? I've been checking on it, you know, I've been staring it so that it doesn't burn you know so as you guys can see it's ready you can see the the oil on it is getting once it's getting like this color you know that it's ready <laughs> so that is it guys thank you so much for watching if you like what you see you like to see more recipes do not forget to subscribe to hit on the notification bell and those of you that keep coming back Thank you so so much. This smell like so good, like so good, delicious. Wow, I cannot wait to try this. Cannot wait to eat it with my rice. You guys try it and let me know what you think. And can you guys see it did not burn? It did not burn. No, you guys see it smells so good, delicious. So that is it in this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Okay.